In this video, I am going to explain causes of stiff shoulders, like what kind of muscles get tight and what kind of muscles make shoulder stiff, okay? I'm going to explain two muscles that can be tight for stiff shoulder, okay? First one is this muscle, this is trapezius. especially around this area. This is upper fiber. Upper fiber of trapezius. You know, when trapezius gets tight, it creates stiff shoulder around this area. By the way, when trapezius gets tight, that can also create headache and neck pain, stiff neck, because this muscle needs to uh, sustain head and neck position. Just, you know, for your information. Anyway, when trapezius upper fiber gets tight, that creates stiff shoulder around this area. First muscle is trapezius. Let's move on to next muscle. Next muscle is this one. This is levator scapula. Scapula, levator scapula. This muscle is deep to trapezius. Imagine there is trapezius like this. As I said, when trapezius gets tight, that can create stiff shoulder around this area. Levator scapula is deep to trapezius and it is about same place. So when you dissect trapezius, you can see levator scapula. So when trapezius and levator scapula get tight, that creates stiff shoulder. Maybe both muscles can get tight simultaneously, or either one of them gets tight individually. Uh, some, pe some persons, levator scapula is tight. Maybe trapezius is not. Or... Somebody's trapezius is tight, levator scapula is not. Any kind of situation is possible. But in my opinion, both muscles can get tight simultaneously. That is why people can have stiff shoulder around this area. First muscle is trapezius. Second muscle is levator scapula. For next section, I'm going to explain why these muscles need to tighten up. There is reason. This is profile view. This is trapezius upper fiber. This is levator scapula. These two muscles, and of course other neck muscles, need to contract to keep spine upward. You know, this is upright position, right? These muscles and back muscles need to contract to maintain our posture upright. How come these two muscles get tight? This is normal position of head. So this is cervical spine. Cervical spine makes natural curve. But when head is in forward position, cervical spines need to extend more and more then what's gonna happen to neck muscles the pedias and levator scapula they need to contract more and more and more to keep upright position does it make sense then what kind of things makes head forward position maybe you look computer and smartphone long time or there's other reasons such as tight muscle. What kind of muscles get tight then makes head forward position? One possibility is this muscle. This is pectoralis minor. Pectoralis minor or pec minor. When this muscle gets tight, that brings scapula this way. 
and this muscle tends to bring shoulder inward, inward position. This is like a curvy thoracic spine. Does it make sense? Then this posture can bring head forward position. It's like a chicken or egg question. Does head forward position makes pec minor gets tight? Or tight pec minor makes head forward position? It's chicken or egg question. But when pec minor gets tight, that brings chest, shoulder inward, this posture oftentimes bring head forward position. Now what's going to happen to neck muscles? The pezius and levator scapula gets tight. Then you have stiff shoulder. That is why levator scapula and trapezius needs to work very hard to maintain cervical spine position. Does it make sense? So this is very, very common thing. I don't say pec minor is only cause for stiff shoulder. Of course, other muscles, other myofascias, or other joints can create tight shoulder, you know, stiff shoulder. But I'm giving you just one example. I hope this gives you a new idea for stiff shoulder. If you liked today's video, please hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. See you next video.